Okay, Harry's. Let's see what is going on for your uh, second quarter 2021. All right, so we have make a decision. Feeling stuck, indecisive, listen to your own intuition and make a decision. All right, so what we're seeing here, Aries, is that in the month of April, there is some sort of a celebration um, that is going to be coming up. Whatever this celebration is all about, um, it's a group of people coming together. So it has something to do with work, your colleagues, um, there could be uh, birthdays because you Aries are in your birthday time. So I see a lot of you Aries uh, for your birthdays is going to celebrate the Aries season is here and begin. Um, and uh, what we see is that uh, the Ten of Pentacles. So a lot of people that has business is going to be having some sort of a problem. But uh, people who are in uh, loan deems. Uh, there could be some sort of a new contract is going to be coming up for you guys. Uh, some of you are happy because you receive uh, some sort of a work. Um, some of you had been looking for work for quite some time. And finally, you receive uh, a new job. Okay, so this is going to be very, very good. Now, business people, you're going to be having some serious, serious problem. Um, a lot of you business people are to pay back a whole lot of money. Um, and a lot of you business people are going to be have to make some sort of a decision because people are going to be coming at you um, because of uh, um, money that you owe out. So, so business people, there is going to be um, some serious repercussion um, that is going to be coming up. But for um a lot of people who are looking for work april is going to be a good month it is good for um you guys to get and to have an abundant as you can um look at all the information in the archive these are timeless reading thank you for being here thank you for being back please remember to like and subscribe so may uh, it's going to be another month. A lot of you could be signing your contract in May. May is a month where a lot of you are going to be connecting and getting um, a new contract. Um, if some of you were worried about whether or not your contract is going to be extended, there's no need to worry because it's going to be extended. Okay, so that is good. Then when we look at June, June is another profound month. Um, is a month where a lot of you are protecting yourself on the work floor, okay? And that is good. So um, when we look at uh, where, um, business people, there is uh, some sort of a secrecy that is coming out. So, um, you know, people who are um, working in a, some sort of organization, this is going to be good. But for business people, they're going to be recognizing that a whole lot of you business people, there is something um, with a whole lot of money that some of you business people could have taken. Secrets is going to be coming out. I see some sort of a deceptive play um, that was transpired in your world. It's going to be changing because people are going to be recognizing what was happening. So a lot of you who were looking for work, looking for a new promotion, this is going to be good. Okay. When we look at the cups, the cups is very important. The cups has the energy of uh, um, protecting yourself because some sort of an information is going to be coming out. And for business people, a whole lot of information um, that was kept is going to be coming out. People are going to be recognizing. People are going to be seeing the truth. People are going to be understanding. People are going to be looking deeper at some sort of issues that was going on and getting to the bottom of a whole lot of issues that was happening and transpiring. And this is going to be recreating 
um, some sort of a new world as to some sort of uh, um, dishonest issues, problems, and situation um, that was transpiring. So it is um, going to be a period of uh, um, the spirit is going to be coming up where a lot of you are going to be getting the promotion, moving up the ladder um, for people uh, who are working and in working deans, but for a lot of you, there is going to be a whole lot of issues, a whole lot of problems when it comes up to business people, managers, um, a whole lot of people who have owed money out, loans and that sort of a thing. A whole lot of information is going to be coming out um, and you have to deal with this. So if you notice on the flip side, there is um, issues, problems, but yet still, these are going to be effect, uh, affecting um, business people. Okay, so it is going to be good for anyone who are in, uh, let's say, you work for another company, some sort of an organization. Um, you got a new job in April. Um, good news in May, you start. Uh, um, promotion comes up in May. But when we look at June, it has a, a situation where you have uh, the energy of uh, um, protecting yourself on the work floor, protecting yourself against uh, um, dishonorable um, actions against you, um, recognizing um, that uh, there is some sort of an imbalance flow um, that is transpiring. Who do you have to deal with? A cancer. They're going to be recognizing something about a cancer, a cancer and a Virgo. And a cancer, and a whole lot of you, is going to be holding a cancer responsible for a whole lot of money, okay? I see a lot of you are going to be saying, yeah, but it has nothing to do with me. The cancer is the one, okay? Then we see you're overcoming um, a huge theft that was transpired. People are now... Um, recognizing you could be the one that found out uh, what I was happening, what was transpiring, um, and people are going to be there. So you're dealing with a Cancer, you're dealing with a Leo, that you're going to be overcoming a huge tech that the Leo have created, and you're dealing with a Sagittarian, and the Sagittarian secrets are coming out. A lot of people are recognizing that the Sagittarian have not been speaking the truth. A lot of people are recognizing some sort of a diversion play of a Sagittarian and a Sagittarian have created some sort of a, um, undesirable breaking the rules and people have been now recognizing what a Sagittarian have done. So a whole lot of information about a Sagittarian and a Taurus is going to be coming out because people are now recognizing the play of a Sagittarian and a Taurus and how they accumulate money business-wise for their business and is recognizing um, how they um, treat their clients and how they create a whole lot of problems for other people and bring a lot of stress in other people's lives. So it is a situation where you're looking at the Cancers, the Sagittarian, and the Leos and people are going to be recognizing that these people have not been speaking the truth. Secrets are going to be coming out of the um, create problems uh, for the company and also um, for clients uh, and how they create a whole lot of mess around people and create uh, um, a sort of a, a undesirable uh, workplace. Uh, um, create undesirable for a corporation institution where uh, this corporation institution has been losing a lot of clients not knowing <clears throat> what was happening and what was transpiring why clients was leaving and now this corporation institution is going to be recognizing that a cancer and a leo and a sagittarian have created a whole lot of issues A whole lot of issues that has uh, let clients uh, move away from the company. So uh, it's really a situation where people are going to be recognizing um, why they have been losing a lot of business. 
um, a whole lot of information comes out how people are creating issues problems okay so we have the energy of 10 but the ten of pentacles where a lot of you business people they're going to be recognizing a whole lot of money that you business people took from a corporation institution or use um information of another corporation institution in order to acquire um some sort of a financial uh, status and to balance out uh, your financial situation in a company and they're now going to be recognizing the play of what was happening and transpiring and how a lot of you business people finance your company by using other people information and data so this is going to be a serious serious issue um that is going to be coming down i see a lot of you business people are going to be um coming in a whole lot of problems because of some sort of unfair situation that was created. Okay, so when we look at uh, um, the situation, we are recognizing that a whole lot of information is going to be coming out. A whole lot of information that was kept behind is going to be coming out. And people are going to be recognizing um, that uh, uh, things is not what they seems to be is as if they recognize that people was creating a whole lot of issues in the corporation institution and you Aries could be finding it out showing it up and some of you business people are going to be in some sort of a serious problem where they're going to be recognizing um the unconventional way that you do business is affecting either the head office or, or a huge corporation and they're going to be recognizing that there was some sort of a foul play that has happened and transpired so Aries it is um, a rare a time where a whole lot of uh, situation is going to be transpiring a whole lot of you that was having problems with uh, work or having problems with uh, um, uh, um, colleagues because I see a whole lot of situation that was transpiring with colleagues. A whole lot of you were having issues um, where it comes on to a Cancer and a Leo and a Sagittarius. A Cancer and Leo and a Sagittarius. And they're going to be recognizing what this Cancer, Leo and Sagittarius has done. So you have um, uh, Saturn. In Gemini, Saturn in Gemini is showing up, and the energy with Saturn with Gemini is that there was uh, information. Cancer in Gemini is also here, and there was information that was affecting um, a lot of you that at the workplace that you were not even aware of these um, information. People were not even aware of what was happening. And the transition that was uh, being created in some sort of an organization institution. So it's as if a lot of you Aries is now going to be recognizing the foul play that was transpiring. And it's going to be trying to bring some sort of a balance to this in order to accumulate some sort of a st stability in your world. And I see that this is going to be coming up. So a lot of you have to be on top of uh, your games because a lot of transition is going to be coming up. I want to say thank you for being here. Um, it is going to be a good quarter for especially um, working um, people, um, business people. You're going to be having um, some sort of an issue that is going to be transparent. But it is what it is. You have to, um, you know, learn. I think it's a new way of doing business, learning to be honest in a new business and understanding the position and what is transpiring in your world um then i want to say to each and every person as you want to see the extended of this reading follow me to the other side for the rest i am going to be saying join the channel as you join the channel take the medium the medium um account you will be able to access um, most of the extended readings, okay? 
So as we look, a lot of you are going to be dealing with the Cancers and the Virgo in the month of April. In the month of May, you're going to be dealing with the Leos, where people recognize that a Leo have stolen a lot of money um, or have something to do with holding on, on a whole lot of money. And they're going to be recognizing what this Leo have done. Then we are going to be recognizing the Sagittarian and the secret of the Sagittarian and how the Sagittarian, along with the Taurus, uh, have created a whole lot of issues. Uh, and I see that people are going to be overcoming the disturbance of what was happening and transpiring. So um, 10 is um, the, the situation where when 10 is there, a lot of people, especially people who were looking for work, this is going to be a good period. People who are looking for work or hoping for some sort of a new promotion, um, it is going to be a very, very good period. So at, um, I see that a Gemini is going to be opening up the door to information that people were not aware of. And it's going to be showing up that a Sagittarian has been very dishonest and has been playing a cruel, cruel game. And um, it can be that you Aries are connected to the Sagittarian, whoever this person is, they're going to be recognizing that some of you Aries could have been connected to the Sagittarian or have worked with the Sagittarian. So I see a lot of you Aries have to make some sort of a decision whether or not you are going to be giving up the Sagittarian and showing up what the Sagittarian has done. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to be moving on. If you'd like to see the extended of this reading, follow me to the other side. If not, namaste.